Hey guys, Ash here from C4E Tech and in this video I'll be showing you how to manually install .mtz theme files uh, onto any device that's running MIUI v5 or later. So in this video you're seeing me use a Mi 4, this is applic applicable to the Mi 3 Redmi series or any other phone that has a MIUI custom ROM on it whether it's official or a port. So as long as you have the MIUI themes app, just go into it and you can go into categories or local and you can actually import from SD card. All right. So in this case, under download, I've got some MIUI fonts that are downloaded. So say you, in, you, you import it, then you just go into themes, fonts and local now i can actually see the font that was in, imported but unfortunately i'm i won't be able to install it all right uh it says it would not support third party sources so in this video i will be showing you how to install the mtz file so the prerequisite here is root access obviously your phone needs to be rooted if it's a xiaomi device it's very simple to root xiaomi devices i'll leave a link to my uh tutorials on how to root the Mi 3 or the Mi 4 and it it wor works pretty much the same way for any Xiaomi device. If it's a custom ROM, uh, if you're running a MIUI custom ROM, odds are you probably are already rooted. So anyway, this is what you need to do. First off, clicking on the link found in the download section in the description will take you to this page on XP XDA developers forums. So from here, just scroll down. and select WSM manager under software download so you can just save it wait for the download to complete now go ahead install it WSM tools and hit I trust this app and launch so uh, you can also quickly go into the security app permissions root permissions i mean turn that on i mean that needs to be turned on manage root permissions i'm sorry and make sure that wsm tools is granted root access you would get a prompt just make sure it's checked uh and let me just go to wsm tools so guys over here click install and hit ok make sure you have a backup you've backed up everything before you do it in the odd chance that you actually get stuck in a boot loop and need to uh, factory wipe or something all right guys we're up so uh, right now just go back to WSM tools all right cancel right now so go to online and now uh, search for okay let's just search for it me tools all right me tools and download the latest version hit install and install again and again i press the zap finish so right now if wsm tools cancel you can update it to the latest version if you want over here make sure that me tools is activated so now changes will become active on reboot so we're just going to reboot the device once again so we're up here guys uh, now let's quickly go into the themes app and uh, go into category edit theme fonts local again and select that font hit apply and there you go the theme the themes applied so uh just to show you again let me go into local import from sd card download and import another dot mtz file so let me just take something random homemade apple import it so going into category edit theme font and under local now that shows up homemade apple selecting it apply and there you go it's applied so that's pretty much it guys a simple way to get uh, to uh, bypass that restriction that Xiaomi has imposed uh, with a new policy Again, I'm not really intending to use it for piracy or uh, get paid up, paid up themes for free. It's just that there are a lot of free themes that are willingly shared by developer, developers themselves that are available online. Uh, creators who haven't yet uploaded to the theme store because it's just a recent change, less than a year old. 
uh, or maybe uh, creators who aren't really creating themes anymore anymore because uh, MIUI has been in existence for a lot for a, quite a long time now, uh, about four years. So there are a lot of themes uh, fonts available online. So if you guys come into something like that, or run across something like that, and just wanna install a .mtz file, uh, .mtz file uh, onto your Mi device or your device running a, a MIUI ROM, this is how uh, you've got to get that done. So anyway, I hope this tutorial helped you guys. If you found found it helpful, if you found it useful, do let us know. Give this video a thumbs up, share it, and for more videos like these, please do stay subscribed. So. Uh, Anyway, uh, if you were wondering where I got this Mifo from, I picked it up from wapmart.com. I'll leave a direct link to that down below in the description. So if you guys do want to pick one up, you can do that by heading up wapmart.com. Additionally, you can also use the discount code C4E Tech to get $10 off the discount code itself and or the value might change in the future. So again, check out the description below. I will keep you guys updated there. So once again, thanks a lot for watching guys. Till next time, this is Ashia from C4E Tech signing off. You guys have a great day. Bye-bye now.